Hi there, welcome back to Mr. Meal's Music. I'm Anthony Meal. Time to learn how to play the game BB Bumblebee. And as always, be sure to uh, subscribe and hit the uh, notification bell so that you're always up to date with my latest videos. Thanks. To start uh, getting prepped for the game, I have my students sit in a circle and they um, keep the beat on their legs to the song. So they'd be going like this. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a bear upon his knee. Just like that. Then I have my students possibly try to move around the room so they can march to the, to the song. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a bear upon his knee. One of my favorite things to do is have my uh, kiddos sit in a circle and then they can actually pat their neighbor's shoulder to the beat so they'd be going like this. Bee, bee, bumblebee. And this lets them feel the beat and also create a beat. So if they notice that they're not doing the same thing as their neighbors, they, they realize really quickly that something's not matching. Then possibly on the next lesson I'd get a little beanie baby like bee or you could even just use a bean bag and you could call it your bean bag and they could ha uh, you'd have your students pass the bean bag to the beat so it'd be going bee bee bumble bee and based on how long your uh, kids hold on to the bean bag they realize that they're the controllers of how fast or slow the song goes so if I get the bean bag and I go ooh this is so pretty well then the song is stuck on that one note. So usually I let them pass the beanbag around once just to check it out before we actually try to sing the song. Then once we're ready to play the game, um, we'd be passing that beanbag to the beat of the song. And at the end of the song, um, I declare that you are out. On the word out, whoever winds up with the beanbag just got stung by the bee. If you got stung by the bee, you're going to be going to the center of the circle and you're in the hive. And in the hive, I would have a bunch of different um, unpitched percussion, so like hand drums or wood blocks or shakers or rhythm sticks, and they'd be um, the beat keepers for the song. So they'd be going like this, boom, 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 boom. And they would be keeping the beat while the beanbag is being passed around. So the beat keepers have to be watching the beanbag. The beanbag passers have to be listening to the beat keeper in the middle. So it's a great uh, way to have your younger kiddos be aware of what else is going on around them. On the next round, whoever winds up with the beanbag last would uh, trade with the kiddo that's in the beehive. And they would be the new beat keeper on whatever instrument they would choose. Um, this is a great um, low risk, low pressure assessment tool. You can see, you can uh, listen to your students keeping a beat. Um, you can see what kiddos are able to pass the beanbag on the beat uh, while having some fun. So that just about does it for BB Bumblebee. If you have any questions um, or comments, please put them down in the comments below. And as always, please share, 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 and subscribe. And I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye. BB Bumblebee Stung a bear upon his knee Stung a pig upon his snout